Okay, so this is the high resolution engine and uh, we're going to go through the setup on it again because it's a little bit confusing or, or confusing is not the right word. It is uncomfortable to people that have been using the regular systems because it has a Z that goes the opposite direction and uh, you'll see why. But I'm going to show you how to set the Z. One good thing is once you set it, you never have to set it again that it stays set. It always remembers and finds out where my where, where it homes the Z. So let's go through and we're just gonna, I, I don't know if you can get a zoom in on the screen here or not I but can. I'm gonna click on the home XY and then uh, there you can see it walked off. Now we're gonna actually have to enable Z calibrate and you click on the Z up here and you'll see that it goes up pops off and then rehomes re itself now it's at zero 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 and actually it's not if you look here the Z is at 100 and that's because we Z the the Z axis we home it away from zero zero is down here in a plane just below the hotbed so we can get all the way down to it but we have to home away from it because we don't know what's on the hotbed we would break stuff if we were driving it downward alright so uh, the next thing we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna pop this stuff out of here we're just going to stick that right there for the moment. Hmm. You can print now. Feel it. That's your precision printing surface because it goes down and it stays flat. There's no bow, no nothing to it. Okay, for the speed, where are we at? So let's go ahead. I have so many secret weapons with this machine. Yeah, it's, it's cool. Okay, there it's we are. The teacher's call, right? The teacher's. Okay, so what we want to do now is we're going to move that. Because we have to set the new zero. Now, if you, you know, know the, the, no, if you know the thickness of this and the thickness of the old one, the difference. Yeah. Okay. So we can measure that, and we'll come right on the money. This is like more precise than these are. Point one one seven, two point nine seven. Okay. So if you come over here to your G code. Okay, and. Uh, We can actually, yeah, that's fine, 80 and 95, that works. And this was going to be uh, 9 point, uh, actually, do I have a 9 or, yeah, I do. Nine point six has 3 millimeters, and we thought it was like, mm, eh. Change it by just one, and we will see it when it starts. The great thing is, he, you figure out how tall your head is, you're never going to have to change it again. Is this locked in place? Yes. Waiting for head temperature. Yeah, I see. Let's see where we're at. 80 and rising. 90. Ooh, Why this is five? Because I programmed it for five degrees. Oh, okay. We actually could we can make this hotter now. Okay. Because when you're printing the plastic, so let's go ahead and change that. I'm gonna kill the job. Wow. If you got a toothbrush, wire brush. There you go. Good. It's a good pie. It's almost perfect. No, just not coming. 
and this was stopped, yeah, it was a little bit weird. It stopped for a while and then it kicked. Like at that moment. It's, it does it only one at the beginning. Right here. It's not sending any more data out. See this? No, it just changed. It's changed again. Okay, it is sending it. Changed again. All right. That's weird. Alright, well we'll see how it goes. Good. Nice. Oh my gosh. 